Hello again, everyone. Here I am reporting from the stunning, stunning Florence, Italy. I know some of you have been lucky enough to be here. My brother studied here, my best friend from school studied here, but this is an unbelievable place. It's pretty hot right now, so you're probably wondering why I'm wearing um, black long sleeves. It's because yesterday in Rome, I forgot to wear sunscreen, contrary to all the advice of my mother. So sorry, mom. I know you tried, <laughs> now I'm burned. But aside from that, I'm having a great time and I think it's about time that I fill you in on all these incredible things that I've been able to do on my Contiki tour. Now first, when we started out, we started out in Amsterdam. Hey. And in Amsterdam, <laughs> I don't know if you heard that passerby, but he must know Amsterdam. We had a terrific time. Um, aside from some pretty cool people watching, I think you can guess why. Uh, we had this incredible canal tour, there was the Anne Frank house, it was unbelievably beautiful. And from there we ventured on to Germany. And in Germany, what we did is we did wine tasting in the Rhine Valley, which has some of the best Riesling white wine that you can imagine. I hope you like sweet wines, because I do. Then from there we went to Munich, we had an amazing time at the Hofbrau house, everyone swigging, you know, swinging around and, and dancing, and there was an Upa band. And from there, we went on to Austria, which is, hands down, the most visually stunning place that I have ever been. There we went whitewater rafting. I may or may not have fallen into the icy cold glacial water. <laughs> cool. I'm pretty agile. Uh, and from there, we actually went to this crystal museum. It's the Swarovski Museum. It may not sound cool, but trust me, it is wild. It belongs in Amsterdam, I will say. Um, we stayed in this tiny village and the people of the hotel loved showing us a good time. All the stars were so bright in the night sky, so it was beautiful. And then from Austria, we totally changed pace. We ventured onto Italy, and I know that I've already given you a little taste of what Venice has to offer. I went to Rome, I've just come from Rome since yesterday, and you know, we saw everything from the Pantheon to the Roman Forum to the chaos that ensued when President Bush paid a visit, right? Um, and then from Rome, we came here to Florence, and I'm having a lovely time. And I hope that all of you are well. I wanted to give you a little taste of everything that I've done, and uh, a little taste of where I am right now. It's Ponte Vecchio. If you haven't been lucky enough to hear about it yet, then look it up, because it is stunning. But here I am in Florence, wishing you the best. Keep in touch, and you'll hear more from me soon. Thanks.